it would be easy to forget that one of Dwayne Johnson's next projects is a remake of John Carpenter's Big Trouble in Little China, given the number of new movies he is releasing almost every day. The cult movie from 1986 stars Kurt Russell in one of his greatest roles yet, giving us a hero in Jack Burton that has been copied over and over. But according to a new report, it seems like Johnson's Big Trouble film isn't the remake we anticipated. In an interview with Seven Bucks Productions president Hiram Garcia, who wants to be clear concerning this, he said, A lot is going on in Big Trouble in Little China. We are working on it. And let me assure you that the goal is not to remake Big Trouble in Little China. You can't replicate a classic like that, so we aim to continue the story. We'll continue the universe of Big Trouble in Little China. Everything that happened in the original exists and is freestanding, and I believe there is only one person who could ever play Jack Burton, therefore Dwayne would never try to play that role. So we're just having a lot of fun. We're actually in a fantastic position with the story that we've cracked. But no remake. It is a continuation, and we are deep into production on it as well. I believe you will hear more about it shortly. Although Garcia claims that Johnson will not take over Russell's iconic role, one can't help but believe that whichever character The Rock portrays, let's call him Schmack Schmerton, would have a striking resemblance to Russell. Otherwise, why make a Big Trouble movie unless Schmack Schmerton is a lovable loser of a hero who is cocky yet in over his head? We'll have to wait and see if Dwayne Johnson's Big Trouble in Little China hits theatres. Dwayne Johnson is rumoured to star as a top-tier supervillain in a Marvel film. He is said to play Apocalypse, the X-Men universe's first mutant, and the immortal ruler of a future wasteland. Is this rumour true? Well, it's too soon to say because these days, new rumours are circulating on social media about Hollywood movies and stars. However, a popular Hollywood insider, My Time to Shine H, spilled the tea and given his track record of accurate insider leaks, it's likely that this rumour is true. The idea of The Rock portraying Apocalypse is not far-fetched, especially with the MCU planning an X-Men reboot, given that several X-Men characters are slated to appear in upcoming Avengers films. Starring N. Sabah Noor, Apocalypse's real name in the Marvel Cinematic Universe won't be a bad idea. He is a powerful villain and a well-known comic book character, but is Dwayne Johnson the perfect actor to bring such an icon into the Marvel Cinematic Universe? But more than that, Dwayne has been having a hard time lately in his career, and Marvel could help him with that. After returning to WWE, which seems like a smart move to stay popular after some recent problems. His movie Black Adam didn't do well, his TV show Young Rock got cancelled, and the XFL had issues too. Johnson is in his early 50s now, and he wants to avoid going from being a top actor to doing less popular movies that go straight to DVD. But with his no-lose clause roles in movies, how does that fit into a storyline with such a major Marvel villain? And with the recent decline in MCU movie performance and ratings, will joining a franchise with several box office flops in a row be a smart move for his career? Tell us what you think in the comment section. While you do that, watch our next video on The Rock.